The China Africa Development Fund has officially set up office in Nairobi with the aim of encouraging and supporting Chinese enterprises to invest in the continent. Over the past 10 years, Nairobi has become a magnet for Chinese multinationals setting up their base in Africa. And that's prompted the China Africa Development Fund to also set up their regional office here. The office, which is set to cover the entire Eastern Africa region, received a $5 billion boost at last year's forum on China-Africa cooperation in Johannesburg, South Africa, bringing its total capital to $10 billion U.S. dollars. It's proven that all this effort is worth it. We've decided to invest in 87 programs in 36 African countries. Once completed, these projects are estimated to help the continent increase exports by 2 billion US dollars and the tax by more than 1 billion US dollars every year. Over 1 million locals will benefit from the programs. In this regard, we encourage more Chinese farms to invest in the country, which is fast growing into a middle income uh, country. So far, CADF has invested in agriculture, manufacturing and resource development, injecting vibrancy into the China-Africa economic trade cooperation and strengthening Africa's capacity to develop on its own and compete in the global economic landscape. The first big project that CADF is set to implement as it opens its doors in Kenya will be the provision of much-needed private housing. The first MOU to be signed between card funds, between the private sector in this country, between my ministry, or in general the government of Kenya, the first footprint will be in housing. And you've had the gap which is there. It's huge, 200,000 units required to be done every year. CADF is one of the eight measures of practical cooperation put in place by President Xi Jinping at last year's forum on China-Africa cooperation. Maria Galang, CCTV, Nairobi, Kenya.